Hi guys! Tonight I want to show you how my convertible queen size bed works. What I have here is a very simple system. I was just, I couldn't wrap my head around how I wanted to build my bed, so I kind of did something somewhat temporary that is completely removable. And um, it's just simple. It's like plywood boxes that I screwed together, and it's a box within a box. Um, I'll show you how it works. What I do here is down here, I separate it into three different boxes. So it's a total of six boxes. There's three smaller inside ones and three larger outside ones. I'll show you how it works. I'll take it all apart and show you. But um, all I do is slide the box out, unfold this mattress, and I got a queen size bed. And then I have a couch during the daytime, you know, for just hanging out or reading or you know, looking through my YouTube, that kind of thing. But it's really simple. I just slide the box out like that, push it all the way to the wall and unfold my mattress. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna peel back this mattress completely so you can see just how the boxes are constructed and how they fit within each other. I'm just gonna fold this back just for now. And, um, I made this out of one big sheet of uh, of plywood and like the grain matches so I think it actually looks really nice as well but this just slides out like this just like that unfortunately I didn't have time to stain my other boxes but I'll be doing that soon enough what you end up with is a little bit of a gap right here in between your inner boxes but you can see the difference in size, that way it can fit right inside. And then, I'll just pull this one out a little bit. So this is all the gap that you have, which is normal. Like if you had a slat bed, you would have a gap like that, you know, every other slat. So you don't feel that at all when you're sleeping in the bed. So the way I built it is that I have storage for bins in each of these three boxes. I can take this completely out of the way. And I can access the storage that is just underneath. There's hats and, you know, cold climate um, clothes, just stuff that we don't use every day. So uh, that's what it goes in here. In another box, I have uh, all my tools. In another box, I have a um, is my like Amazon wish list box uh, has all my Amazon wish list items and projects in there that I need to do on the bread truck. So those will be coming soon. The nice thing about these boxes is that I have floor all the way to the wall. I can just lift these out and get rid of them, unload them all outside of my truck within just a few minutes. If I wanted to ever do something different with this space, very easy to remove. Okay. What I'm going to do now is I'm going to go through the entire process of how we convert this couch into a queen size bed every night. I just take the blankets that are on here, including the pillows, and I set them out of the way. I start at the front. Slide each box out. And then unfold the bed. Oh, it's got a little, it's got a little duvet cover holding the mattress together. Take the sheet and put it out. <laughs> then I bring back my quilt and pillows. and make the bed. As you can see, it's pretty easy. All you gotta do is slide some boxes out, unfold the mattress and make the bed. Um, you know, I've really always wanted like a dedicated bed that's always a bed that you don't have to convert, but this works great for right now. It was a pretty cheap and simple solution to needing a bigger bed. And it's really comfy. It's really great to have such a big bed. It's like my own 
you know, master bedroom suite on wheels. It's great. <laughs> you can do all sorts of things in here. <laughs> like what, Polly? This is where the magic happens. <laughs> wow. <laughs> This bread uh, truck sure is rocking. Is it? It's squeaky. You hear that? Yeah, I think the whole neighborhood hears it. <laughs> I'm surprised we didn't have any comments in the last video. How, the, how squeaky the truck is. Good night. This is how we go to bed. This is how the bed works. <laughs> this is bed in a van. Yes. Bed van. I mean, <laughs> van bed. <laughs> Done this bed work great. <laughs> You're like, oh. My arm's already getting tired. I feel the burn. <laughs> yeah. I think we're working out tomorrow. <laughs> right. <laughs> we got a date with the beach and the sun. Do a workout. Your gun is digging into my hip. <laughs> 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 the next day. Good morning. Good morning, guys. And gals. Hmm, okay. Well, time to get the day going. Okay. Time to show you how to put the bed away. <laughs> it's your turn. <laughs> it's your turn for YouTube. Morning, Tube. I woke up like this. <laughs> she woke up like this. Okay, time to get up. Putting the bed away is just the reverse of what you saw in the beginning. You just take all the stuff, set it aside, take the blanket, set it aside, fold that up, slide these boxes in. Boom, that's it. And you put the blankets and stuff back on for daytime. Pretty easy, right? That was quick, wasn't it? What was that, like a minute? Mm -hmm. Something like that? Yeah. We usually do the blankets together, so it's a little Yeah, it's easier. a little easier with teamwork. But you'll see, just a second. I can do it by myself too. Not too bad. Mm. And then we make our breakfast and we get on with our day. What do you think? Ta da! Ta da! Ta da! You're just a natural, regular old Dana White. <laughs> Oh uh, yeah, that's me. Oops. Pillow down. Put the pillows back on it. Okay. There she is. That's it. That's it. And now you open the front. To the bright, sunshiny morning. Feel the breeze. Ah. So much breeze. Thanks for watching, guys. See you on the next video. That's my van life convertible bed. Super simple, super easy. Thanks for watching. Make sure you hit that like button make sure you subscribe there'll be a lot more cool videos coming soon <laughs> so stupid